Welcome to the 100th video of Unfold Data Science. This video is very special for me and entire Unfold Data Science family. So I thought of doing something different. What is that different? We'll have some fun with behind the scene videos. I'll talk about the journey of Unfold Data Science. I'll also talk about some motivation behind Unfold Data Science. And towards the end, I have some special surprise for you. So just ensure to watch the video till end. It will be fun. Now, where shall we start? Of course, the fun part, right? So what all can happen when you shoot a video tutorial? Let's see some of the videos. This can happen with you when you shoot a video tutorial. Flow of collaborative filtering recommendation engine. Okay. Now, that was funny, right? Now, sometimes you forget to switch on your mic. So this is what can happen. Welcome to Unfold Data Science, friends. Good, isn't it? Sometimes you just shoot in the flow and then suddenly a fruit vendor comes on the road and starts shouting. In this video, I'm going to talk to you in detail. How do you prepare? So all these funny things, right, keep happening when you shoot a video tutorial and when you are shooting near to the street. I mean, my home is near to the street. Okay. Now moving on to the motivation behind Unfold Data Science. So if you ask me what was my motivation of starting Unfold Data Science, I'll tell you in one line sharing the knowledge. Now when I started the channel, I was also not very sure that I will get so much benefit from this channel. What all benefits I'm getting from this channel? Let me give you a few examples. Just have a look at this video. Hello friends, welcome to Unfold Data Science. My name is Aman and I am a data scientist with 9 years of experience in data science and machine learning. In today's video, I am going to talk about data science in plain English. Apart from that, this was me in my first video and you can see me right now. Do you see the difference? Do you see what has improved? Is it a good improvement or bad improvement? You have the answer. This is just one part of it. What else had changed? Now, if I have completed 100 videos, then obviously I have a good command over those 100 topics, right? Similarly, if I have to create a new video, the very first thing I should do is I should go and study in depth about that video. So two things I have discussed. My presentation skills have improved. My learning has improved. What else? Now many people know me in data science community, right? So all of you at least know me that I create data science videos. So there is a possibility that tomorrow I might go to attend the interview and the interviewer might have seen my video. What impression that gives to the interviewer? You have an answer. Now by giving all these examples, what I'm trying to tell you is do not hesitate to start a YouTube channel. Do not hesitate to start sharing your knowledge. You don't want to start a YouTube channel. Fine. Just write some blogs. You are comfortable facing the camera just start talking about your knowledge on the camera even if one person is benefited your efforts in creating the video is worth and there are some blockers which people think of while creating the videos or while uploading the content on internet for example people might think that you know you need to have a very nice camera you need to have a very nice mic light setting this that blah blah but that's not true what i'm shooting right now is with my phone and the mic I am, you know, talking with is a simple Boya mic. I'll give the link in the description. You can very well start with your smartphone and this mic and whatever the lighting arrangements you have at your home, you can start with that. No issues with that. Okay. And tomorrow when you want to, you know, create more professional videos, you might add on to the different mics, different lighting settings and all those things. But these things should never be a blocker for you. That is what I'm coming here to say. So by any means, even if you write a blog, you shoot a video and upload, you contribute in a, in a you know, group or channel or a Facebook page or some discussions, Quora question and answers, all these things, the person who is getting maximum benefit is you. That is about the motivation of sharing knowledge. So let's talk a little bit about the journey of Unfold Data Science. Now, I was a part of various groups in LinkedIn and Facebook regarding data science and machine learning. I saw that many people are asking similar kind of questions like what is data science? How should I start learning data science? What are the different key areas of data science? 
so i just thought of sharing you know these kind of knowledge on youtube so that people are benefited that is where i started this channel in august 2019 now i started with data science basics what is data science how the future of data science is looking like what are different areas of data science all these things then i moved on to python for data science then i moved on to basics of machine learning regression how do you deploy a model how what is meant by model training what is meant by model testing then i moved on to different ensemble learning techniques decision trees and random forest and bagging boosting those kind of techniques then i moved on to recommendation systems then i moved on to neural networks and in parallel i was also sharing common knowledge on how to build your career in data science so what all has been covered as part of that is how do you grow your network in data science what kind of projects you should keep in your resume in data science what kind of data sets you should work on how do you relate your current working knowledge with data science how should you bridge your career from some other career to data science all these videos have been created by me as part of how do you become a data scientist step by step so all the links are there in the description of this video you can go ahead and watch all those are different different playlist so i plan to create videos on these two tracks mainly in future one track will serve to the people who want to understand the high level concepts like how to move to data science how to create a bridge between their current job and data science these kind of videos i will create as part of track 1 as part of track 2 i will create more detailed videos which means if you want to understand how lstm works if you want to know how to write a python code for model implementation those kind of things i will discuss as part of track 2 having said that now we are standing at 100th video and nearly 3000 subscribers so many of you have been writing me your personal queries through the google form that the link is there in the description unfortunately i am not able to answer to all of you but there are ways out number 1 i can do a youtube live which i am doing on sundays this sunday also i will do youtube live and number 2 which is the surprise part of this video we can also have a video call right a webinar kind of thing so why don't you drop your email id in comment of this video and i will pick top 50 email ids in terms of first come first serve and i'll send you a meeting invite where we can have a webinar you can ask your queries to me and i can answer you you can ask your follow up query i can answer that as well that will be interesting right so just drop the email in comment of this video and i'll pick top 50 email ids and send the invitation so i hope you like this video i hope you like the motivation part i hope you like the fun part and all other things about the video i'll come up with another interesting video till then all of you stay safe and take care